I'm Shank.com here. Today we're taking a look at WritePad for iPad. WritePad is an advanced handwriting recognition software that will essentially help you uh, create notes and uh, write articles and things like that on your iPad. And this is where all the magic happens. This is the screen where you will create your um, articles and text. And at the top right over here, there are several options that will help you navigate in terms of uh, what writing style you would like to choose. So right now we're just in the viewing mode. As you can see, the document is selected. If we go ahead and select the pencil, you can see red lines appear, and that will allow us to um, write rather than scroll. So if we write inside the lines, for example, this is A, and it will automatically convert your handwriting into text. As you can see, it was right after the dot, so it, it wasn't capitalized, but if you continue writing, it will recognize your handwriting quite well, actually. So there you go, this is a sentence, handwritten, perfectly translated, so that's very cool. Let's go ahead and just create a new document, you could go ahead and tap plus. Actually, let's go ahead and exit out of this, and a fast way to do this is just to tap the plus button right here, and we could go ahead and create a new document. So as you can see, it didn't quite get this because my, my writing wasn't as as good as it should have been. And you could actually go ahead and make changes simply by tapping the keyboard button in the top right navigation. That will allow you to use the keyboard to make changes to your text. So this is what we wanted, this is a document. And we could jump back to our editor like so. Another editing style is this sort, <clears throat> this sort of boxed style over here, and you could go ahead and use this instead. And th what this will do is essentially translate the text into this box. So there we go. Maybe take that back a little bit. This is a new page. And as you can see, it automatically uh, takes the text you have written and puts it into the document when you start writing at the beginning of this box. So this is a page. There we go. Let's start Let's just edit this out a little bit. Start a new sentence. And there we go, let's finish that off. Just like that. This is very easy and very cool. We could actually configure a few options in the settings panel. And there's actually an extensive number of options. I'm not going to go through all of them, but I will uh, briefly jump through the window so you could go ahead and pause and explore various options. Uh, there's different font styles, different uh, themes. We could go ahead and insert contacts. Uh, this actually syncs with various cloud services like Box, Microsoft SkyDrive, Dropbox, Evernote, and several others. We could actually do this by uh, visiting the share menu. And you could go ahead and export the PDF, send via email, and things of that nature. You could go ahead and configure various options. For example, you could change the theme. You don't like orange, maybe you like brown. There's various themes to choose from. As you can see, it changes the header color. There's other options for the editor. 
as you could see there's tons you could edit the user dictionary the autocorrect list you could go ahead and add and subtract different things from there uh, the shorthand list provides shortcuts uh, you can manage the recognizer data and also text to speech and various other options you could also go ahead and read the detailed help about how to use WritePad so you could use it to its full potential there's various gestures and symbols that you could use uh, while handwriting and there's also the about page so there you go WritePad for iPad very cool and advanced handwriting recognition application for iPad go ahead and check it out on the App Store <laughs>